Okay, I'm like so tired of starting this video over. I want to let you guys know that this is my poem. I wrote this last year for the poetry ministry at my church. I also would like to let you guys know that this poem is not about me, although they are my words. Um, I cannot sing, although there are singing parts in this poem. I will be singing them so I can perform them for you guys. But when I did perform it, um, it was done by a singer that I know. Um, okay. Longing for companionship, desiring to belong. No self-worth. Disrespecting her body, abandoning reality, she struggles with her addiction. From one guy to the next, sex gives her power that she relinquishes at the end of the night. She begs and pleads for them not to leave, but her power is temporary. Chasing love at the bottom of empty bottles, drowning in shots of tequila, Remy and Patron, they represent her sorrow. Been around the world, or should I say, the mean streets of Baltimore. And I, 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 I can't find my baby. I meant to say baby daddies. Angered by the faces that remain, representing the many failed relationships, diseases caught and cured. Her heart is broken, and all she has left are these miniature replicas of those who used to be. With everyone that leaves, they take a piece of her only. She now defines herself by the clothes she wears and the style of her hair all for attention covered in makeup seduced by the fast life fast cash and bright lights governed by lies and broken promises succumb to the world a runaway she ran away from the place she called home and into the arms of the streets she ran away from her problems only to be chased down by defeat reduced to selling her body for a small glimpse of what she calls L-O-V-E. Her reputation exceeds her, so the guys won't bother wasting their time. She called this place home, and in these streets that used to embrace her, now they want to erase and replace her, finding herself all alone. Ingested, disrespected, unprotected, now infected, rejected and digested, she's been flushed with the waste. Miscommunication of what love is, mishandled by those she thought cared, misguided by unspoken laws, magazine covers, and infamous blogs. Miserable. Unsuccessful at life. But she forgot one thing. While she was out in the clubs, passenger seat riding, in drug dealer cars, flashing jewelry and diamond rings, that walking beside her donning angel wings, a guardian angel or so she thought had appeared. Sleepless nights led to hour-long dreams and a voice saying, My child, I am here. I'll give you comfort for that's what you need. With the weight of the world on your shoulders, to me, you should speak. I am your father, all-knowing, and it's me you should seek. And in me, believe, I will never leave you nor forsake you. Get ready for your breakthrough. Of your sins, you are free. You can have all the clothes, money, but you will never find true happiness, wholeness, and a real love like mine. I forgive, my child, and of you, I have need. For before you were born, I gave you purpose and destiny. She responded, over the others, other men, pimps, and pretend friends. Over my pride, was prideful. Lacking self-worth, self-respect, and self-esteem. Over my flaws. A life lacking love, responsibility, and acceptance. I have in my life. Mistakes made, some repeated, lying, stealing, and deceiving. I choose you. I choose you. I choose you. Okay, I'm done. Hope you guys liked it. I was kind of nervous. Um, I'm not recording this again, so that's it. Bye, guys.